Hello, my gorgeous gastronomes and vampires. Welcome to T-Rex Steel City Mukbang. Where will this food journey take you today? Pull up a seat. Let's eat. Hey guys, how you doing today? Happy weekend. We got a Saturday and tomorrow we got a Steeler game coming up. Yeah. I want to thank all my subscribers first though. Thank you guys. I love you. And to those of you who have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. All right, guys, we got oxtails today. Oh, yeah. Yeah, guys, we got oxtails, collard greens, rice and peas, carrots. You know how it goes. You know how it goes. And of course, there's an oxtail link on my cooking blog. Look at that. Mouth-watering. Oh, gosh. Mm. Mm. I just realized my mic wasn't on. I'm glad I know this now. We're doing hand eating today. So if anybody's grossed out by it, by the culture of other people, keep scrolling. Don't be rude about someone else's culture. If you don't like it, don't watch. So guys, apparently we're not safe. even in our own neighborhood from mass shooters. Couldn't find bubbly. I had to settle for lacrosse. And it really is a settle. Can't touch bubbly. Or Canada Dry. But anyway. We're, I'm speaking of Raleigh, North Carolina. The mass shooting there. A couple days ago. Fifteen year old shooter. Are they going to claim fetal alcohol syndrome again and keep him from the death penalty? Like they just did with uh, the Parkland shoot? Mm. I don't get it. We thought as long as we didn't go to the movie theater or to the concert, or to the grocery store. We would be safe from a mass shooter. 
or to school. Apparently not. This kid walked into a neighborhood in Raleigh, North Carolina. And just indiscriminately started shooting people. People that were just out and about in their neighborhood. Walking their dog, washing their cars, on their way to work. And this miserable, ignorant, troubled punk shows up. with a shotgun two guns I really don't know what type two guns and just randomly start shooting people it's never gonna end it's really never gonna end You know, it's sad when you say, well, thank God, he only got to five people. <laughs> huh? He could have shot up the entire street before he got stopped. But he only got five people. One person is too many. They have to start to do something. How did a 15 year old get his hands on two guns? So you're not even safe to go out and cut your grass or walk your dog in front of your house. Nowhere safe. You have to look over your shoulder everywhere you go. Even outside your house. Disgusting. You want to know how good this is? Or can you tell? Oh my. It's really good. We're going to make an ox sales. Well, as close to authentic as possible. We'll just say that. Very near authentic. Be sure to check out the recipe on the blog.
thought I had a bone. This is it. Last one. <clears throat> These oxtails were a little thicker, so I put them on for like a hundred minutes in the instant pot. thicker they are, the little more time you should give them in the Instant Pot or whatever you're using. I swear by the Instant Pot because it's so fast. A hundred minutes. And you know this would take four or five hours, six hours. in a pot on the stove or slow cooker. Mm -hmm. I don't even mess around anymore. Straight to my Instant Pot. Okay. Peace out, my gastronomes and vampires. I will see you soon.